Football fans gather under the Friday night lights at high school stadiums across the state. They are subject to the usual excitement from the cheerleaders and the chance to be with their friends outside of the classroom. But on this night, before the Lakewood Ranch Mustangs have a chance to run for touchdowns, local mascots will have a race of their own. We caught up with Coach Cummins, part of the athletic department here at Lakewood, to get his take on his, this unique event here at the ranch. In an effort to increase our sense of community or our participation within the community, a couple of our coaches came up with the idea that we'd have a mascot race. A lot of Major League Baseball teams do this on a regular basis, so they thought we'd give it a try, and uh, the community was more than willing to help and support. And I love coming to the football games every Friday when they're home, especially since it's the first time that they're doing the mascot races. I think it's very cool because I know that they do it at the race stadium with like the water bottles and the soda, so I think that's pretty cool. So, with the participants in place, a cow, a pirate, a horse, and an ice cream cone, we're about to see who had a leg up on the competition. The Chick-fil-A cow lost its footing. The Marauder's Pirate was next to go overboard, leaving the Culver's Cone and Clumpy, the Lakewood Ranch Mustang's mascot, galloping towards the finish. In the end, it was the hometown hero Clumpy, ahead by a hoof, leaving his cone competitor dripping with envy. All of the organizations involved had a chance to promote their establishments, and the fans were entertained before and during the game, which is what a night like this is all about. Good friends, good fun, and great football. From Lakewood Ranch High School, I'm Tori Boudreaux, varsity reporter for Bright House Sports Network.